Hey guys, it's Twilight here, and we're back in the world of Lost Odyssey. Last time we left, we just got to the town and went down the elevator. So let's see what shit's changed. Industrial Revolution, Aura's undergone tremendous growth. Magic sure is a force to be reckoned with. Oh, thank you very much, kind sir. A meteor fell on the highlands of wool. A meteor, how insane is that? What happens if another one falls here? Oh! If you want to ride the monorail, go up to the second floor, assuming the monorail's even working, that is. I don't know who it is, but someone keeps throwing trash into the vase. It'd be nice if there was someone else who had picked it up, too. We're at war here. We're at war here! Welcome, this is where you go if you need directions or any questions about how to use the monorail system. We also handle PA system announcements, monorail... Status reports and lost and found services here. Let me know if you need anything. <laughs> Drop off lost item. Hmm, I believe we just had someone inquire about this earlier. Oh! The ring was a gift to the owner's finance, who... Fiance, who is a young soldier, and he was quite distraught. I'm sure he'll be happy to... If you ask to present a certain item to whoever brought the ring here, so please take this. We'll get out of here. Oh. You gotta remember to kick those. Doggy! <laughs> okay, wait. I'm trying to talk to the talk to the owner. Of course the people are benefiting from the magical industrial revolution, although there are still who fear the power that they don't understand. And this happened. Okay. Wait, no! Oh, fucker. Oh well, I'm sure I'll be back. I'll probably explore on my own time. Anyways, can I touch... Touch ya? Can I examine these? No? Okay. So, I thought I was... Was hoping to get a TV today. Um... A new one for my room. That didn't happen, unfortunately. Kinda saddens me. I'll get one eventually, I just didn't get one today. <sighs> the one I thought I was gonna get was... The guy said it wasn't as good as I thought it would be. It was on sale, it was a, looked like a really nice TV for a good price. And I almost got it. Uh, magic taxis. Anyways, I almost got it, but I didn't. What else is around here? Oh, someone I bet The monorail is free because it's wartime, but those guards on watch freak me out a little. This is the boarding area for, area for Magic Taxis. Unfortunately, it's out of service at this time due to orders from above. So, it's out of order due to orders. That, that seems like a... That seems to be a problem with that statement. It should say it's closed due to higher orders. This war has cut drastically into our clientele. Hopefully we'll have our old bustling city here before long. <laughs> hey there, what do you think? Hasn't she got beauty a real car running on our magic engine? Can I zoom in? Hee <laughs> So that's a car. Okay. The war will undou undoubtedly end after such a horrible tragedy. The council is apparently convened for emergency talks. Uh oh. Oh, I remember this area. For some reason, this area is very familiar to me. Or rememberable, I should say.
Well done. You may leave. Huh? Uh Lieutenant Kaya Marganar, we thank you for a job well done. I am Roxiel, Chairman of the Central Council of Ura. Well, Lieutenant, it seems people are calling you the Immortal. We've heard there were almost no survivors from Ura or Kent after the meteor crashed on the highlands. And yet, you appear to be unharmed, even though you were presumably at the precise point of impact. Tell me, how did you survive? I don't know. My lord, please allow me to explain. Fine. Speak. Thank you, my lord. Actually, this man is immortal thanks to my magic energy. He is under a spell of immortality that I conjured. Hmm. I wish to know more. This immortality spell, how does it work? I don't know. What? Are you saying that you don't know about the spell cast on you? I don't remember. I recall nothing. My lord, uh, this man has lost his memory. However, he is skilled in magic energy. So I have been studying his abilities. Then what can you tell us, Gongora? With all due respect, my lord, the spell is a curse. It is said that merely hearing it brings death near. For the safety of everyone, it is better that the spell be kept secret. Hmm. Very well. Since I trust your studied opinion, I shall take your word that we should not know the spell. Death is determined by fate, and one cannot fight it. Lieutenant, since it seems that you cannot be killed, the Council would like to bestow a special mission on you. We want you to go to Grandstaff. My lord. Gongora, you cannot keep this hidden any longer. Till now, construction has been left up to you, but we've lost contact with the site. It's just that... Gongora! Until we can confirm that Grand Staff Project is safe, construction shall be suspended. Yes, my lord. So now, Lieutenant Argonar. You know of Grand Staff, under construction in the Sea of Bas? I've heard that it's a magic staff. Yes, it is. As you just heard, all communications with the site have been cut off for some time now. Considering the danger from magic energy leaks, we suspect that no one can investigate the possible cause, except someone immortal. Well, there is someone else. What did you say? At the Wall Highlands, another immortal. Her name is Balmor. Hmm? Well then. This other one shall accompany you. I shall summon her. Quickly, make the arrangements! Right away, my lord. My lord, pardon me for saying this, but I'm building Grand Staff for the sake of our nation and its people. Enough! We will await Kaim's return and report. Of course, my lord. You are dismissed, Lieutenant. Thank you for coming, Lieutenant, Lieutenant Organar. I have a word from the Chairman Roxine that you are off duty until further official orders from the Council. There is a fine inn just along the street for you to stay away for your orders. We have already arranged for the Council to contact you there. I want to check something. I don't remember having to push A on cutscenes, so I'm going to see if there's a thing here. That does it automatically. Back row. Uh, 
I don't see anything. All right. Anyways, it's worth a check. Oh wait, it's the same guy. Wait, whoa, whoa, what? Okay. Look at the same guy three times. Alright, while I'm here, I guess I should take, make a pit stop. In fact, I think I'll uh, pause the recording. I'll see you next episode.